What's going on everybody? So in today's video, I just kind of want to talk about the custom tournament that I played in. Uh, it was hosted by the dojo or uh, basically the main site for uh, Warzone custom tournaments. And I will have to say, I have learned a lot when it comes to playing in customs compared to like playing in pubs. For one, this is my first customs game. And uh, we actually ended up placing seventh overall on the leaderboard. Uh, the top teams, you know, they, they're actually crazy. I was just playing with a couple of my buddies and it was an enlightening experience. So the one thing that I want to say right off the bat that if I was playing on mouse and keyboard, there was absolutely no way I would win half of my gunfights. It, it, it's crazy. Uh, the fact that uh, everybody has is just a laser beam, the fact that snipers are just incredibly overpowered. Well, there wasn't snipers in the, in the custom, but everybody was just lacing you, bro. Like you had to play extremely well in order to even you know get kills you have to try to single out uh targets because you're going up against three really good people and they're it's just a whole different experience a whole different mindset and a whole different play style i will have to say like pubs it's like whatever even sweaty skill-based matchmaking right it, it it doesn't even compare when it comes to playing in customs and it, it, it's just an enlightening experience of like how good of a player you actually are how good you are uh, with like your team and how good you are with uh your decision making and everything right uh everybody like even the gulag fights bro like i i, I didn't lose a gulag fight right um but even then it was just absolutely insane like the gulag fights i would have to say like if when you go to the gulag I, it was really fun it reminded me of like cs like trying to figure out like okay what angle are they playing what what are they doing they have smokes they have nades like well, where where can i not get shot at right and how do i counter this play that the enemy is making it's literally a chess game at a really high level and i know that it wasn't like the top teams that are qualifying for like war series of war zones but still like everybody in there is pretty good and um or i would say like above average right they're they're above your average like pub players and they're communicating it's just a complete different experience the way you rotate if you think you gotta throw a smoke throw a smoke right if you think you have to put in like mortar something pop a uav like you really can't second guess yourself because things are happening incredibly fast at a super fast pace teams are trying to third party you it's absolutely insane and really really addicting bro uh i i am addicted to warzone custom right it, it's just something that is just uh, it's super super interesting and uh there, there's entry fees you know in order to get into these warzone customs but you know i'm thinking like maybe and you guys let me know down in the comment section below i pick two people up or one person up and we, we we go into these warzone customs so you guys can experience how it is right uh i i will say if you are not huskers or if you're not bread man you're going to get laced those guys have years of experience when it comes to warzone customs dude i i wouldn't even try it man like the skill level that these controller players have like just hitting every single bullet if you miss a bullet you are ab it's not even if you miss a bullet like if you don't get like upper body shots and a headshot mixed in there somewhere you are getting laced my guy and girls like you or well, whatever jelly these gentlemen you know whatever you want to categorize yourself as because you know we we are we, we support all type of people here <laughs> no nick mercs no cap just kidding just kidding we love nick mercs uh, but yeah dude it, it is something else and it has really pushed me towards like getting to the upper skill level on a uh, controller right uh you know playing 6-6 six, six with a 0.85 or 0.9 uh, ADS is really easy. I'm thinking I'm gonna be sticking to 88.9 just to like raise that bar to raise that skill gap just a little bit higher and just to you know try to get better at the game. Uh, it, it's something that I haven't felt since competitive Counter Strike when I was playing in Face It tournaments, ESCA tournaments. And don't get me wrong, I am not the best. Like it was my first tournament ever. Like I was lost the first three games, right? I did not know what to do. It was just a completely different play style. But I feel like if I go into these every weekend, because that's when most of the tournaments are, We, if I get some people, we go into it like every weekend, uh, you know, and guys, if I'm picking you up, right? I'm paying for the whole thing, like the whole team, right? I'll be the team captain, you know, enter the scores and everything. 
I, it's, but it's just something that like warzone needs like we it, it's not like ranked it's not anything like that it's just something that is fun everybody's streaming everybody like you have so many viewers because you stay in the lobby uh you have so many spectators i should say and it, it's just fun in my personal opinion just seeing how teams rotate seeing how everything plays out seeing how people like actually uh their decision making in certain gunfights how to actually win those gunfights it's something that is uh I, I am really uh considering uh really studying and uh, let me know down in the comment section below if you guys want to see like some videos like this of like we just play custom tournaments like i i, I love it man it, it is so fun uh, i was playing with rocket and legals my buddy our but my buddy chris and adric and uh it's people i've been playing with forever um and it, it was an enlightenment man it, it, it was fun it was <sighs> it, it got me low-key addicted i'm not gonna lie and i know a lot of you are gonna be like well why aren't you doing it on mouse and keyboard and like guys like if this was warzone 1 or mw like 2019 engine like heck for sure bro we would totally be playing on mouse and keyboard but like mouse and keyboard is at such a disadvantage and i don't have the time to put in like how i did when covid was around like we were uploading every day and we were playing for like eight hours a day but now times have changed everybody's going back to work you know i'm working and training a lot of people uh even though i have one one person left but that's when the grind comes back i think my time is better on controller i i know i made a video the other day like we're doing both like in pubs yeah dude i'll play on mouse and keyboard it don't matter but like in these warzone customs and like actually trying to get better at the game you know i i think that this is something that i could really put my mind to and get really good at if i put the time in i've been playing a lot of uh rebirth like solo quads and just trying to figure out how to break teams down how to stay alive in certain situations um and just i, I not reverse boosting or like two boxing or anything like that because i want to play against good players i want to play against players that are going to push me to get better like you can 1v3 a 1v4 a team of bots right but like when it comes to playing good players that's not going to help you so that's why i i don't uh two box i'm not um i'm not reverse boosting or vpning or anything like that it's just literally me playing the game and trying to get better so let me know down in the comment section below if that's something you guys are interested in um uh, like i said i am low-key addicted and uh just having a good time uh by the time this video goes up i'll be uh live streaming or potentially towards the end of the stream i'm trying to start streaming every day at five o'clock eastern standard time streaming for three or four hours um and just trying to uh over on twitch by the way twitch.tv forward slash the dryer newt uh you guys should uh, come check me out over there but we're just on the grind man like a fire has been ignited and uh it's something that's super super exciting um i'm not giving up on mouse and keyboard i'm not giving up on you know the tips and tricks but i feel like focusing on this is going to like make me a better player and understand everything as always, guys, I hope you stay uh, blessed and stay humble, and I will catch you in another video. Like I said, let me know down in the comment section below. What do you guys think? Are you are you interested in this? Uh, do you think it's something? Not too many channels I, I noticed do this, so uh, I feel like it's something that the channel needs. Uh, let me know down in the comment section below what you guys think. Always, I listen to you guys. I read every single comment. Even though I can't reply to all of them, I read every single one. Um, so, uh, yeah, hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your evening. Peace.